my name is Stanley Mwia. I'm the general manager for Adrian Kenya Limited. Adrian Kenya uh, Limited is a lead provider of technology and EPC solutions in East Africa with operations in telecommunication, power and ICT sector, enabling companies to their innovative needs. Adrian Kenya has a capability to deploy uh, both off-grid and the grid tie uh, solutions. As an overview, overall I think we, we, we have completed over uh, 300 uh, projects, uh, I mean cumulatively spanning up to 10 megawatts uh, of, of, of power uh, for the last three years. We have two commercial models uh, in, in this solar technology that we deploy on different customers. Uh, one, one of them is, uh, is we call it uh, a financial uh, development model where Adrian Kenya comes in to do feasibility study. They do the financing, they do the design, supply, installation and commissioning. This model is um, where we engage in a customer in a leasing model. Adrian Kenya develops the whole solar plant in partnership with different financiers. And what actually we offer as ed product is the power, the energy to the, to the, to the customer. And we charge them monthly. We operate the plant between uh, a period of 15 to 25 years, then we hand over the infrastructure to the customer. The second model is uh, the EPC contracting model, and Adrian Kenya comes in to, to do the engineering, procurement and uh, contracting for the, for the entire project. Uh, this model is where the customer invests, uh, does the cap, uh, capital investment, and uh, Adrian Kenya does all the work up to the commissioning and add over the project. Our market niche um, spans all the way from uh, government institutions, uh, commercial enterprise, learning institutions, and of course, industrial. Adrian Kenya and University currently are in partnership to uh, deploy a 65 kilowatt uh, solar system. The University of Embo being the first adopters uh, of this uh, technology, they'll be able to, to use the solar plant that we are currently deploying for the practical skills uh, for their students. And of course, the other students from the neighboring universities and their branches for their learning. Uh, my name is uh, Professor Daniel Mugendi. I am the Vice Chancellor of the University of Embu. As far as uh, the public institutions are concerned, is the first one to take this uh, bold step. When we are looking for an installation partner for the solar energy, we had three key considerations. The first is the technical capability. The second is the um, financial capability of the partner. And the third is the experience. Our key differentiators in the market, one is uh, the process management on how we manage the solar projects. We, we have uh, expertise in uh, all our managers. Uh, our project team, project managers are satisfied uh, by PMI. We have experienced uh, technicians and engineers who all of them have the required licenses from IPRA, from the NCA uh, to really undertake the, the, the solar. When institutions adopt this green technology, there are key benefits that are associated with that. And the obvious one is uh, the cost savings uh, that come uh, from using the solar as a natural source and of course it's being complemented with the grid availability and the other sources of power. With this system we normally use it during the day when we have most of the electrical activities or rather the activities that consume more electrical power and during the night when we have less activities that is when we shift to Kenya power. With the adoption of solar, we have managed to save our bills by up to 30%. Globally, everybody is talking about the technology, is talking about the power savings, and technology adoption is one of the key benefits. Uh, the second one is um, uh, the scale transferred. I would say that, uh, I mean, uh, in the electrical engineering field, um, much of it has been on the DC power systems, has been on uh, the normal grid power, and now we are moving to more of renewable energy, solar, wind. I think um, as, as the world moves to embrace the green energy, there will be a lot of need uh, for skills transfer, all the way from the academic institutions to, to commercial.
The cost management is really key uh, for the institutions. The benefits of uh, introducing solar to the ecosystem is, is really uh, very good. Uh, I think the last one that I would say that is uh, environment conservation. Uh, I mean, the principle of uh, conserving environment is, is good for the business and for the community.